Hi, I'm John from Zombie Army Productions, and today we're gonna show you how to make boots. They could be vines, they could be roots, but they are definitely an affordable way to create set dressing for your haunted house. Boots, go get them, go get them, boots. Hi, today I'm gonna show you how to make our boots. You're gonna need stuff for your vines. Anything from old hoses, wires, you've got ropes, anything along these lines will work. You also wanna get your tools. You're gonna need tie lines to hold them up. You're gonna need zip ties, knives, scissors, chip brushes, buckets. You're also gonna need some fabrics. You've got anything from burlap to erosion cloth, cheesecloth, which is my favorite. Again, whatever you have laying around, we call them garbage roots for a reason. You're also gonna need a lot of good old fashioned all purpose white glue liquid latex, and then you're gonna be looking for paint in at least two different colors, a base coat and a highlight, possibly even a contrast if you're feeling adventurous. Yeah! Step one is building your structure. I recommend garden hose. You can use just one or you can braid and twist several together. Basically, you wanna zip tie up at the top. That's magic right there. Zip tie every few feet to keep your work together, but you wanna build a nice solid structure to put your offshoots on. Once you get that, you've got your ropes, you've got your wires, you've got your tubes, whatever you've got laying around, and start weaving them in, zip tying them in. Basic thing here is to create some fun forms, some natural structure, and all sorts of dangly bits, because vines are made of dangly bits. We've got, I would say, an offshoot every three to four feet, um, and the offshoots should be more towards the middle than the ends, you know? You don't want it to look too uniform. Now you're ready to build your structure. You can go ahead and use one and a half parts of your white glue to one part water. You wanna take those fabrics, dip them in, squeeze out the excess, and begin wrapping your hose. You tell me it was sticky. You can keep them bundled, you can keep them separate, you can alternate all your different fabrics for different depths and textures. Once you have a nice hard, dry structure, it's time to paint. You want to use your liquid latex and that base coat paint. Two parts latex to one part paint. Get it nice and mixed and start painting that structure. You want to get deep into all those cracks and crevices and get a really good coat in there. This not only will make your vine look a little less like uh, burlap, but it'll also help keep it smooth to the touch for your actor's safety. Once your latex shell is dry, it's time to detail paint. You can take that highlight color Start to add it in as needed. But remember, haunters, don't spend too much time detailing on something that may just be sitting in the dark. There you go, kids. You've got your creepy boots. They could be vines, they could be roots. Either way, they're an affordable solution for set dressing in your haunted house. Yeah!